Hey everybody, thanks for jumping back in and checking out this video. My name's April and I am the Wolf Ranch Girl. Everybody. So we are going to be doing the October weekly plan with me. So I will post a card above or somewhere um, to link you to the monthly. I was doing the monthly and the weekly together, but the videos were just too long. Um, so I'm trying to break them up and see if you guys like those better. So let's get to it. Okay, so we're going to jump into, this is actually the, it'll be this page, this is actually the second week of October, um, the first technical week of October was here, and this is the last week of September, so I just go ahead and add that to the September month, um, and this will act as our first week, so we are going to be doing this for October 5th through the 11th, and I actually have a combination of a leftover kit from Jump To It Design that I bought um, last winter, and this is what I call the home kit. Um, from Jump To It Design, and I'm going to be using the day headers and um, the banners or the large washi for this week. And then I'm actually going to this is actually a printable kit. Okay, so this is actually just paper, but it's such amazing quality. The images are so wonderful. So I'm actually just going to cut these out and I'm going to be using um, these for my um, full boxes. So let's go ahead and get started with that. pieces that I'm deciding to use um, cut out and um, I'm not using a huge amount of them but they are cut out and um, these are the three that I'm not going to use this time and I have everything kind of laid out so um, now I'm just going to either use my Elmer's glue dot runner which is um, just little glue dots, or a lot of the times I just use a plain old glue stick to see.
Okay, so this is the end result, and I think that this looks really, really great. Um, so I have my weight tracker here, my calorie tracker, my water tracker. I'm actually tracking my blood pressure now um, a few times a week. And then normally I have my meals going across the bottom, but since I used the large washi down at the bottom that I just love, um, I'm going to be having my meals listed over on the side here. So I think the combination of this um, looks really great and uh, I will be keeping this printed version because this would look really cute in the spring so I may use this one week in the spring but the beauty of these printable um, sticker kits is that I actually can just not keep this if I don't want to and reprint it because I own the print and it's just printed on paper. Um, so that's really nice and you can't really tell at all you can't really tell the difference between these full boxes and um, the full boxes here. You don't know if these were stickers or if these are cutouts. And you can't tell with that here either. Um, and then I just had some embellishments from uh, my headers from Planner Kate. Uh, these coffee stickers were Planner Kate. And then this weekend um, foiled sticker is actually from Jump To It Designs, which is the same place that I use the um, Days of the Week headers and the thick washi down at the bottom. Okay, so now we're going to move on to the week of the 12th through the 18th, and I'm actually going to be using this really lovely um, kind of dark floral design um, from Erin Condren. Okay, so this is the um, finished week of the 12th, and I do like how it turned out. Um, I don't think that I will be buying sticker kits very often from Erin Condren because there's just not enough stickers. Um, so I kind of had to piecemeal things together and pull things from my different books. Uh, the actual designs are really great, and they're beautiful uh, with the flowers, but I just had to pull things from a lot of different places. So now I'm moving on to the week of October 19th, and I am again using an Erin Condren um, sticker kit because I had ordered actually um, several of them for this month, and we'll see how those things turn out. week and this is Halloween week um, so this is the sticker kit that I'm gonna be using <laughs>
finished week of um, October 26th through the 31st, so Halloween week. Um, so I was able to pull just a few stickers um, from that are Erin Condren stickers from other places to finish this out, and I think it looks okay. So the headings, um, like I've said, are Planner Kate. This is a Planner Kate weekend header. Uh, these are my last two Planner Kate coffee stickers, so I'll have to um, reorder those. And then I think that this looks really cute. Um, you can see that it's got the black background with the flying bats, and that is actually the same as my cover. So starting the month out with a new cover and then ending the month out with the same design. So let's go ahead and go through and review um, what we put together. So this was the month. And then here's the first week, which was a combination of a Jump To It Designs home kit and a uh, printable kit that I actually had to cut out and glue. And it looks really cute. And then the week of the 12th is an Erin Condren kit. Just the lights. You guys can see it doesn't look like black blobs. So it's kind of maroon um, and just very dark background, kind of transitioning into the Halloween season here. And then the week of the 19th, also an Erin Condren sticker kit. I just supplemented with some other stickers. That turned out pretty cute. And then we jump into November for the last week of October. And another Erin Condren kit. So I think it turned out pretty good. Um, I don't know that I'm going to order any other um, or a lot of the Erin Condren sticker kits. Um, I really do miss having the meal area down at the bottom. I really, I feel like that takes away a lot of real estate <laughs> in my planner. Um, I mean, it's fine here, but if I need to make additional notes, I just don't have enough room over here uh, for what I like to be able to do with my meal planning uh, for the week. But it does look nice and I don't mind doing it sometimes. Um, I wish that they did offer more full boxes instead of these quarter and half boxes. Uh, it just kind of makes it awkward in the sticker placement or at least for my sticker placement it makes it a little bit awkward. So um, overall I think that I was pretty happy with how things turned out. And I'm definitely looking forward to fall and the cooler weathers uh, and being able to get outside and not sweat to death. So that is my October weekly plan with me. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. I hope that you um, found something positive and productive that you can use to help navigate this crazy life. So if you um, like the video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you would like to see more content, subscribe and hit that notification bell wherever it is. And you guys have a great week. I've got to go and get ready for school.